Hey yo, what is poppin' everybody? Welcome back to another video. It just rained a whole hell of a lot. I mean, it's been raining since, uh, it's like 1 p.m. and it's like now 5 and it just stopped 15 minutes ago. So it is quite wet out here, but it's good for the turtles. They love it. I mean, uh, the wood turtle's out. She's right, uh, there. Sort of. Down, meh. Over there. That general area. But yeah, everybody loves it. Um, everybody's doing good out here. As you guys may or may not know, I am going to Daytona for about five months, four to five months. So I'm taking all the reptiles, all the turtles, all that stuff with me. But the one thing I can't take with me are the fish. Simply cannot take them with me. It's just too much, too much work to bring an entire system filled with giant fish. 300 miles across the state so what i'm gonna have to end up doing is uh, i have a friend who's coming to take care of them while i'm gone he's gonna do water changes and feed them and do everything everything about you know all about that stuff he's gonna take care of them while i'm gone but i do have some fish that are inside inside my quarantine system which was also my main fish tank at the 75 gallon and uh, since i'm not gonna be here i'm gonna drain that and just empty it uh the fish have been in there uh, the, one of them has only been in there for a month, but I'm sure he's fine. He's um, He's been eating. He's not skinny. He's um, he's an Oscar, so if he had ick or any sort of parasite, you'd see it. And he's also acting really well. So, and the other one is doing just fine, too. The clown knife has actually been in there for two months now. So the clown knife is just about ready to come out here anyways. So, I'm going to go in there. I'm going to try and net those guys out. That's going to be hard say the least because they are big fish they are adults well the clown knife isn't but the oscar is i'm gonna try to net them out and bring them in here uh as you guys remember i did a water change the water's looking beautiful everything's clear yeah they should do fine out here since they were wild caught around here so the temperature shouldn't affect them everybody else even the hybrid and my other albino clown knife they're fine which means these guys are gonna do just fine too but yeah I gotta drain that tank, just empty it completely. It's gonna be, it's gonna be sad to see that tank empty. It's not sad empty for uh, what is it? Four years now. It's been running for four years. It's been salt water. It's been fresh water. But it's it's always been running since I got it. This will be the first time I see it empty. Well, second time I see it empty. First time since I got it. Put it that way. But yeah, let's go inside. Let's start draining the tank and try to catch those big fish. All right, so there's the Oscar. He's going into panic mode because he saw me coming next to the tank. He is still a wild fish, so he's still kind of scared of people. Here's the clown knife, doing great. I'm gonna start draining this bad boy down and try and net these guys out. All right, so we have the tank draining. Now we're gonna catch the fish. Before I catch the fish though, I gotta get a bucket and I gotta get some tank water in here. Just, just so these fish, I have a place to put them to acclimate and also while I'm transporting them. Cause I'm not just gonna net them all the way over to the pond. But, all right, I'm gonna let this bad boy fill and then use this big old net to try to scoop them out. Let's see how that goes. All right, so I caught them, as you guys can see, they're in here. I tried making it as less stressful as I possibly could, but you know, transporting fish, it's always stressful on them. But here they are, there's the clown knife, there's the Oscar, perfectly healthy. Um, Oscar is actually displaying some pretty cool colors, if you guys could see that. You can't, because it's too dark, whatever. I'm gonna let these guys acclimate by sitting them with their bucket right uh dang it i dropped the bamboo in there 
as I was saying, by letting them sit right there. Grab that. And I'm gonna let them acclimate right here. Water's level. It actually feels to be just about the same temperature too. So I'm just gonna let them sit for 30, 30 minutes. And then I'm uh, throw them in the pool pond. And also, what is the clown knife doing? Buddy, come on. He's stressed out. He's all right. We'll have him in here in no time. The guard's coming to check out the bucket. But all right. I'm also gonna try scoop as many of the minnows as I can before I dry vac the entire thing. By as many, I mean all of them. I'm not gonna let any of them die in a dry vac. If they do get sucked up though, um, I should be able to scoop them up from the bottom of the dry vac and they should still be fine. So that's good. They won't be killed instantly. Which is better than nothing. But I'm gonna, they're all feeders anyway, so they're gonna just go into the pool pond with everything else to be eaten by, you know, everything else. But all right, let me try scoot those guys up. <laughs> Alright, so as you guys can see, I've caught every single minnow in that tank. That was painful, but I didn't want to get them, you know, let them get sucked up by the dry vac. Uh, so I caught every single one of them, and here they go. Bye bye, minnows. No one's left, alright. How are these guys doing? Alright, y'all are doing good. Actually, I think they are just about ready to drop into this main pond. So, let's do that. All right, so there's the new clown knife. <laughs> the big gar is actually already checking them out. There's the GoPro, it's still filming. And down here, I think the Oscar went under this. I'm just gonna let him relax for a little bit. Clown knife is currently sitting on the GoPro, sitting behind it, which sucks, because it would make for a pretty cool shot if he was sitting in front of it. But oh well. Uh, there's the big gar, swimming around. Everybody was swimming out and about earlier. Uh, I don't know where the big clown knife went. Uh, he just backed up. You can see his little trail that he left. He's backed up over there. He's probably gonna go in those bricks in a second. Maybe. Oscar is gonna do what Oscars do best, I'm guessing, and he's probably just sitting under this. Yep, there he is. He is quite, quite big, too. Lovely Oscar. What a guy. So, oh, there he is. He's coming out. Yeah, these guys are in the pool pond. They have been quarantined, they should be good. I dumped all the minnows in here. So, yeah, we're good to go. I just gotta keep draining that fish tank inside, clean it out completely, and we're done. Oh, 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 little Oscar, or little clown knife just saw the big clown knife, I think. He just flipped out. Oh, what's going on here? Let's see if they're gonna, are they gonna fight or what's going on? Because, now remember, Oh, there he is. He's going nuts. There is an albino clown knife, and there's a regular clown knife now. Here's the albino. Look at him. Oh, what is up with him? Ooh, hi. Okay. okay, this is interesting. Interesting behavior. If I do see fighting... Uh, oh, there's, a, there's a little turtle chasing after the gar. If I do see fighting between these two clown knives, I am going to have to dump that one in the big pond out front, just because... The albino's my little baby, you know, ghost I've had since he was like that big and he's over a foot long now So I'm gonna choose ghost over the wild caught But yeah And now they seem to be getting along just fine. No more fighting. That's good All right, I'm gonna grab that GoPro in a little bit actually I'm gonna I'm just gonna let it roll for a little bit See what it catches and then I'm gonna grab it All right, so it is getting quite dark. Well, not really. As you guys can see, the sun is very bright. I can't see, but it's getting dark over there because of all the trees and all the shade. And uh, the new fish are currently hiding because, you know, they were just added. So we'll be back tomorrow morning when the new fish have kind of gotten used to things and they're swimming around again. Ready, ready? We're gonna transition. We're gonna warp right now. Ready? Whoa, Whoa here we are. All right, it is the next day. Um, yeah, I warped on a different 
time and location. But uh, we are back. The fish are doing well. They are, um, well, currently hiding, sort of. I added some new rocks and stuff. Let me show you guys. I added some new hides for them just because there is a lot more fish in here now and I just wanted to make sure that everybody had a place to hide. So I added one more brick, I added some rocks. You can see Ghost, the clown knife, is using it. But the other clown knife is actually sitting right there, sitting in that brick over the, over the hybrid cat. And in the brick right next to it is the Oscar. And they're all chilling in this area just because all the hides are over here. Gars are probably over there. They like to stay out in the open. There's the Pleco, as you guys can see. But yeah, all the fish are doing pretty good. There's one of the turtles. They're all doing fine in this pond. I'm going to do one more water change before I leave. Which uh, I'm probably going to be leaving early next week instead of today. We just got a bunch of stuff still going on here. But yeah, they're doing great out here. Sad to see the 75 empty, but... Yeah, I gotta go. Can't keep that running. I mean, I could. It would just be a pointless expense, though, because I just it'd be running electricity to run the pumps, and there'd be no fish in it for five, four or five months. There's no point, you know. It's better this way. But yeah, the pool pond's looking great. All these new fish make it super fun to feed. I fed them earlier, and they were all coming up trying to eat. Especially the the big gar is. Definitely my favorite, but that's because I have had him for three years and I've done three years of hand feeding. So he is super fun to feed. Same with Edgar. He was just right here. I don't know where he went, but Edgar is also fun to feed. He's just, he's a turtle, so they're curious. He comes up and eats whenever. But yeah. So I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. Uh, you can't see my face right now. It is too dark. And... Here we go. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button, comment, and um, when you do subscribe, hit that bell like notification icon to be notified of when I upload more videos just like this one. Yeah, that's it. Peace.